Okay guys, so as promised, I said I would film a week of outfits. Is that what I said? Anyway, something along those lines. And so that's what I'm doing today, okay? So this is going to be kind of, I don't know if I'd say different, but I know in a lot of week um, outfits of the week videos, they usually show you on those specific days what they wore. But usually when I'm getting dressed and I'm getting ready to go somewhere, I'm usually in a rush. So this is more going to be like outfits I've worn recently and I'll tell you where I wore the, each outfit so you kind of get like, oh this is what Michaela would wear to this occasion or this occasion or that occasion, so on and so forth. You get that vibe, okay? So if you're interested in seeing how I would style things for different occasions in my early 20s life, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please follow me on Instagram if you're interested. That's where you I post most of these outfits, so you'll see them sooner. Okay, let's get into the video. Okay, also I want to say I'm sorry for the rickety sound that you might be hearing. If I don't have the autofocus on, then you're probably, the outfit and stuff will be blurry. So I'm so sorry. Okay, so first, this will say it's Monday. So if you watch my vlogs, then you might have seen this outfit. But I've worn this outfit for work. And I work um, in a fashion business and I it's more casual and so I can kind of wear whatever as long as I look somewhat put together most days um so yeah I'm wearing this very thin knit from Susie Shear my mom got myself and her matching sweaters and there's like these sparkly silver flexes in them like little threads in them that I feel like add that extra pop to it and I'm wearing a navy um, camisole underneath but as you can see like you can kind of see my skin underneath it is very thin so it's you could wear it in like current Canadian weather which is transitioning from spring to summer but has not fully made up its mind and yeah it's fitted and I love it it's really flattering then I have the super wide I'll put in a clip of on the screen because I don't have room to show you my full the outfit but um i'm wearing these super wide um like jeans from mango and then i also have this big tote from mango and like i mentioned in my haul this could literally it's a great travel bag as well it can fit so much then i have boots from matisse you'll see them in the video because again i can't show you the full thing and then i have the basic jewelry I wear all the time, which is my Chanel ring, these, this set. I thrifted this watch, and then this is from Topshop. Again, from like when I was grade nine or grade 10, I'm now finishing university. So super great buy. This mini pearl necklace is, it's a silver light ball necklace, and it's from Mango. And baguette earrings from Numbering, which I ordered, it's a Korean, um, jewelry brand, but I ordered it from Essence and that is outfit number one. So This is the next outfit and this one I wore to hang out with friends. I went to the mall with Excuse me three friends and I did two three friends and Yeah, it's a pretty extra mall outfit But I am extra and I was going out with my fashion student friends like those who I went to school with so I feel like they were gonna get the vibe and I kind of feel like since the that I kind of feel like I want to be extra I say this and then my next outfit's not that extra but anyways I just feel like I want to enjoy dressing up and I think we should and it doesn't really matter where you're going but have fun with your clothes you bought your clothes so where Anyways, okay, so I'm wearing this bedazzled kind of white um, button-up and I feel like it just kind of elevates your everyday basic and then I'm wearing this really long linen like taupe skirt from Zara as well. I sized up so that I could like tuck things in and also I have a wider hip compared to my waist so I sized up. It's a size small and the shirt is a size medium. I also got this really thin belt from Massimo Dutti and I really really love it. I don't really accessorize with belts but I felt like this one would really help one bring this look together but even in future help um 
just really elevate a look like if i was just wearing this outfit or even future looks without something to kind of like break up two pieces it could fall a little flat so i felt like this belt was one to add to my wardrobe and it was one that if you're a slightly more minimal dresser that it won't overwhelm your look but complement it then i have this little black velvet bag that i'm pretty sure i stole from my mom and yeah it's the only like dressier black bag that i have and then i just paired it i don't know if i can show you guys these black boots they're leather and they go above my knee and they're like fitted all the way up and i think i also got them five years ago which is a testament to why shopping purchase and then of course my classic accessory pairing so yeah this is the following outfit i really like this outfit this is one of my favorite outfits that i've worn in a while okay so now we've kind of reached mid end week so this outfit is one that i have been kind of like waiting to wear i think i showed it if you've been following this channel for a while this i featured in a haul during i think 2020 and i got it off the real real and the brand is adm and it's this kind of like beige but the beige is a little bit more gray undertone but not fully grish grish color it's still i would say more in the beige um family and this is an outfit i'm wearing to go out with my best friend um we're going to a museum we're having a little museum date and she's also in like an arts program not fashion she is I would say pretty fashionable um so i feel like when i'm going out with friends that are into fashion or arts that i'm more likely to wear my pieces that are a little bit more i don't know not out there but a little bit more i don't know i feel like they'll appreciate it more and they'll get what i was going for and so i feel more excited to wear those outfits when i'm out with them so it's a dress and it's kind of asymmetric hopefully you can see it in the clip but this side is like more just like a line and then this side has this um ruffle effect i feel like there's a correct term but it's not coming to my brain and i decided to go more simple on accessories so i just have the classic silver um ball beaded beaded ball necklace and then my chanel ring and then my most recent purchase is this gani bag and it's nylon and it has um like a leather strap you can also remove them so if you just wanted to go with the small like the top handle which is also really cute but i felt for this look if I only had the top handle it was slightly too formal for what we were going for and I really love the silver hardware and then this kind of like detail here and the reason I got this bag I kind of spoke about it in the vlog but I've been looking for a bag that's in between casual and not formal so like you have like super super cash which would be like a fanny pack then you have casual then you have business casual and then you go like more formal this would be like my casual bag <laughs> does that make sense the same way like a lot of people buy the prada re-edition bag for just easy throw and go i like this one more than the prada one because i think it's a little bit more different the shape is quite interesting it's almost like an egg i just think it's really cute and i like that it has the silver hardware and not a lot of people have this bag it's also a lot more affordable so there's this bag that I'm taking with me and then I'm wearing the same um, knee-high leather boots um, that go all the way up so there's really no leg showing it's only my arms that are out and that's this look okay this okay I know I said that the one of the other outfits was one of my favorite outfits at the moment but this is truly one of my favorite outfits at the moment because Fun fact about Michaela, even though I love fashion and I love dressing up and I love pieces that like just look beautiful and make you feel beautiful and just enhance your already natural beauty, 
Mikhail likes to be comfortable. There's nothing that makes me, I think, maybe even feel like I think what makes me feel the most confident is where when I'm wearing really good pieces that look really good and feel really good. I don't know why that was so hard to come out, but I'm literally, it's like pajama set with a trench coat essentially. So I have this black trench coat from Mango and I'm gonna call it now and I'm gonna say this is probably gonna be in my best purchases of 2023. Just putting it out there now. And then I have a basic white button up. It's not even really oversized. It's like slightly oversized, but it's kind of true to size in terms of fit. And um, it's white from Mango, classic necklace. But this is the bigger version. This was the smaller one. And the smaller one goes a little higher. But I'm wearing the bigger one today for a change it up. Yeah, please, Michaela. Classic ring, always. And then I'm wearing my favorite track pants that I've ever found. Well, I didn't really find them. My dad gave them to me. They were my dad's. And they're just these black Eddie Bauer, like, track pants. And they're a similar material to the bag. And they're like a straight leg, so they don't cuff at the bottom. They also have the little zippies at the bottom kind of thing. And they're slightly long for me because they were my dad's and I'm only 5'2". And then I just kind of buttoned up the shirt, tucked it in slightly, let it hold, like fold over a bit. I paired it with the silver flats that I got from Zara and the, the Ghani bag again. And I feel pretty put together for this being like, I wore this outfit or a similar outfit to get my nails done you saw in the closet clear out oh, and the last vlog that i uploaded i've worn this outfit or a version of it to hang out with my friend after work and i actually even wore this to work there was no one in that day but i wore this to work and it still looks pretty dressy even though i'm wearing like a button-up and track pants so yes love this outfit this is one of like this is a very Michaela outfit in the sense of like, Michaela, one thing, okay, things that I love are crop jacket, like things that, odd, you know those things, okay, you know those things that when you see them in the store or you see it like on a website and they automatically make you excited, you know, some people are shoe people, some people are bag people, but I am a crop jacket girl. That that is me okay so i'm wearing this sparkly black um crop jacket from maj it's also surprisingly very thin like i can't really show you but it's super thin so i also really like it because you could wear it in spring summer fall winter and it just depends on how you layer it i'm just wearing a camisole underneath and then i paired it again with the black pants we wore on monday and this is an outfit i actually also wore to work but it was for an evening shopping event that we had and i just kind of like switched out some of my jewelry so i'm still wearing my small ball like necklace that i wear it's the only necklace i basically wear and then instead of like my chanel ring which can also be dressed up but i decided to go with this one instead and it's like sparkly with little diamonds all over to kind of bring out the jacket and then i'm wearing like i said the pants then i have these black booties they're leather um, and they're from Matisse as well, but the heel is a 2.5 inch and I kid you not They are so comfortable wore them throughout the whole event and I was standing talking to the guests the clients and stuff like that And then I also have worn them through Ikea for five hours They're great. They're great and because they're real leather the stretch that they have Kind of molds to your foot more and gives you more like breathing room so i really love this outfit it's it's casual but i could i would say you could wear this to a dinner again if you have a work event that's a little more casual but you still want to like maybe jazz it up ha having something like this a small little jacket that has like embellishments i think adds a cute extra touch so yeah this is the last outfit of the week 
Okay, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. I actually thoroughly enjoy doing this, so hopefully we can do some more in the future. They do usually take a little bit more effort because you're to, having to change in and out of clothes. But I don't know, it's really, I enjoyed it and I enjoy sharing fashion with y'all. So let me know if you like videos like this or if there's any other types of videos you'd like to see. I would be interested in filming that for you. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram for more outfit content um yeah okay i think that's all for now i feel like there's something i'm missing but i'm just in a good mood and yeah okay i hope to see you in the next video okay bye